Earlier today, moving trucks were spotted parked outside the historic governor's mansion in downtown Sacramento. Brown moved into the mansion in 2016 and was the first governor since Ronald Reagan in 1967 to live there. And when one governor moves out, another moves in. Today, California's new first family announced they will be moving into the historic governor's mansion. CBS 13's Mark Thompson has more on the transition. Moving day at the governor's mansion. Workers this morning doing the heavy lifting, moving Governor Jerry Brown, along with his baby grand piano, out. At the same time, Governor-elect Gavin Newsom announcing he and his family will soon be moving in. Newsom's camp releasing the following statement, reading in part, Monday they will move into the governor's mansion along with their four children, their two family dogs, and their family bunny rabbit, and reside there for the immediate future. They look forward to getting to know their new neighbors and becoming an active part of the larger Sacramento community. This is a big announcement. Mayor Daryl Steinberg says Newsom's decision is a great source of pride and a big boost for Sacramento. What's a little bit different here is that Governor Newsom and Jennifer Siebel Newsom, they have four kids. And so they're making a decision to raise their family here. And that, to me, says a lot about them. And it says a lot about Sacramento in very positive ways. Governor Brown and wife Ann moved into the governor's mansion back in 2015 after the state funded nearly $4 million in renovations to the 1877 three story Victorian. Newsom will be only the second governor to move into the mansion since Ronald Reagan in 1967. Big changes. We'll, of course, be watching as Newsom is sworn in and moves his family into the governor's mansion on Monday.